So I have actually saved the absolute biggest hornworm for last. Hello everybody. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be feeding my tarantulas gummy worms, aka hornworms. So yeah, it is the most wonderful time of year. The time of year that I can dress up like a spider in public if I was going into public and nobody would question it. I don't know, I feel like I could probably get used to wearing this a lot. So comment down below. Let me know if this is my new, um, my new thing. I don't know. This brings me so much joy. Anyway, okay, let's feed tarantulas. Okay, so we are going to start off with this Pamphibedius species. This is the new one that I'm not very familiar with, although I did read it's called the chicken spider, and there's a lot to uh, a lot to learn here, but it already dug a nice little burrow out, and it's already got a very good appetite, so let's go ahead and see if we can get it out. And here is just a little worm. It seems uh, interested, but I don't know. Oh no. So it's right down here. I'm gonna just take this and I'm guessing it does not want to eat it. There's a pretty good look at it, but yeah, unfortunately it doesn't wanna eat today, so that's okay. Here is a speedy little friend we haven't seen for a while. Please don't, oh, oh my God. You guys remember this is the Brachypelma Toledo Coddle Shidori that took me on quite a run when we did this uh, Zilla enclosure build. So, all right, ready, set, go. <laughs> oh, good job, little one. There we go. That is some intense fang action from such a little one today. Wow. Okay, so let's try something arboreal. My Carabina Versicolor. She's hiding. Let's turn some light on her and see if we can get her to come out. All right, I think this will be a pretty good sized worm for her. We're just going to put it right there and see if she comes to it. Oh, there's that toe. Oh, boy. Ah! Good job, and look at her. She is super blue, and so is the worm. Okay, I don't know about this one. I'm not sure if we're gonna get a shot of it. This is my OBT, and we are very sketchy, but I think we are like right down in this little hole. And I think this will be a pretty good size if it comes out. I hope it does. I see its butt. Yep, do you guys see it? Yeah, there's its butt and its little toe. The consensus is, is that it's too scared to come out. <laughs> so I'm gonna set it aside and hopefully we will catch it out later because I'm pretty sure it's gonna take it. But we have a lot of other tarantulas to feed, tarantulas that I know are gonna come out and eat, so we will leave her to her privacy. Okay, so this is my S. Rebronitans female. All right, let's see if she'll come. Oh my gosh, she's bolting all over. Bet we could get her to come out this way. Maybe. So there she is. There's the worm. No? Okay, never mind then. I guess we'll uh, try another another time. Okay, so now we are going to do a tarantula that never lets us down. And of course she runs into her hide, but that's okay. That's okay. There, see, look, she came back out. Oh, there she is. Very pretty. Pamphibedius species Machala, and let's give her a three, two, one, worm. <laughs> oh, best catch today. Very, very pretty. Oh, oh, the OBT, the OBT just took it. Ah, oh, we missed it. Why do you have to be so shy? Okay, I'm not really sure if this one will eat. I can almost bet she's not going to eat, but I know you guys like to see her anyway, and I know she's hungry, and I know she will eat eventually. No, no, no. Okay, let's, let's try, look, here's a worm. Take the worm. No, why are you, stop it. Why, do, why can you not just like be a normal spider that like doesn't want to be, <laughs> ah! Seriously, anytime we do a video with her, she always just has to come out to say hello. But I mean, I'm not gonna act like I don't enjoy it because I definitely do appreciate all of her adorableness. 
Why are you so pretty? But you can't stay out because I have to feed the tarantulas. Now I'm gonna be stuck like this for like 10 minutes. So she is actually a really good example of a tarantula that does not eat hornworms or superworms. Unfortunately, she is the type to enjoy crickets. So we will let that thing wander around and she's gonna act scared of it for like a few hours and then I'm gonna find her eating it later. So yeah. Sorry about the glare, but yeah, she's got it. That's crazy. I almost never catch her eating like, oh no, she didn't. It got away, of course. Okay, she's just gonna play this game for like the next hour. <laughs> Let's go ahead and see if Shadow wants to eat. I don't know why we are like up here. All of my tarantulas are like acting so weird today. I'm gonna try to get this one to go down. Yeah, I think it's because I rehoused a lot of them recently, if you guys caught that video. So we are just all being weird. <laughs> Look, we already filled our water dish up with dirt. Like, I just rehoused it. Yeah, look. Yeah? No? Okay, we definitely want it. There's just some questions. Two very boring minutes later. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, there we go. We have this girl over here. Look, she's stalking that cricket. We have my OBT out, finally. She's enjoying her meal. This little one is walking around all over, dancing, super happy about the worm. Now, this is a tarantula I do not ever expect to let us down. L. striatopes, female, and we are gonna give her a huge worm. Like, I'm talking like huge. We're gonna do this, let's do it right. There. Oh. I knew she would take it. She's really getting some pretty adult colors too. Like she's this really pretty gray color. And you just see that like slight flame on her rump. It's like really subtle, but it's so pretty. I just love her coloration. But yeah, I'm super glad we rehoused her recently because I have seen her out a lot. And I think that she's getting bigger and braver to where she's not gonna hide all the time. Okay, so. Ugh. Look at this girl, it's my Brachypelma Hamori, and I'm gonna give her two little hornworms if she'll take them because <laughs> I have an extra since someone didn't eat. Pretty sure we will take another. You want it? Yeah, take it. Yeah. <laughs> Two hornworms, cool. And now we just have one more tarantula left to feed, but it is a big girl and a big hornworm. So this is gonna be a pretty good finale, I think so. So I have actually saved the absolute biggest hornworm for last. And that's because this big girl just molted and I think she's gonna really enjoy this big, big, big squishy one. Here we go. <laughs> yep. No problem. That worm was so big and she took it like no problem at all. Unfortunately, we have to look at her through the glass. Look how pink she is now. It's like insane. She's like so pink. So there it is. We have a bunch of tarantulas that have just eaten a lot of blue worms. And yeah, I think that's a wrap. <laughs> Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to like it if you did. Subscribe if you're not. And you want to be. Don't forget I have an Instagram that I use probably way too much. It's at tarantula.cat. You can go follow me there. I also have a Patreon, Teespring, and a podcast. It's all linked down below. Also started using TikTok. That's linked down below too. And yeah, okay. Thank you so much for watching. Stay spooky, everybody. Stay safe.